Today on Math with Rob, we're going to be talking about the second derivative difference quotient. The difference quotient for the second derivative of a function is given by f prime prime of x equals d squared of f dx squared, and that equals the limit as h approaches 0 of f of x plus h minus 2f of x plus f of x minus h all over h squared. We will derive this formula for the definition from the slope formula. We will compute the second derivative of f of x equals x squared. We will assign an exercise and cover the solution. If it's true that if f of x is n times differentiable, a difference quotient exists whose limit as h approaches 0 is the nth derivative. So let's try to derive the expression for the slope, from the slope formula. Remember that the second derivative measures the curvature of a curve at a point. It measures how fast the derivative is changing at a point. The slope formula is y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So if you let y2 equal the forwards difference quotient, f of x plus h minus f of x over h, and let y1 equal the backwards difference quotient, the left-hand derivative difference quotient, f of x minus x f of x minus h over h, and you let x2 equal x and x1 equal x minus h, you can find the derivative of the derivative. So substituting these expressions into the slope formula yields the second derivative difference quotient. So f of x plus h minus f of x over h minus f of x minus f of x minus h over h all over x minus x minus h yields, uh, when you simplify, f of x plus h minus 2 f of x plus f of x minus h all over h squared. Now we take the limit as the uh, horizontal distance h approaches 0 uh, to find the actual second derivative. So in this example we will um, cover the special case of the function f of x equals x squared. In this example, f of x plus h equals x plus h squared, f of x equals x squared, and f of x minus h equals x minus h squared. So we take the second derivative, f prime prime of x equals the limit as h approaches 0 of x plus h squared minus 2x squared minus plus x minus h squared over h squared. We expand the difference quotient, x plus h squared equals x squared plus 2xh plus h squared, and we expand the other um, square, x minus h squared. That will be x squared minus 2xh plus h squared. And then we uh, simplify the, the top of this quotient. x squared plus x squared minus 2x squared is 0x squared. 2xh minus... Um, 2xh is 0xh, and h squared plus h squared is 2h squared. So we're just left with 2h squared over h squared. Notice that this has a removable discontinuity at h equals 0, uh, so we can divide the h squared over the h squared, and we get the limit of 2 as h approaches 0. Now, um, when we take the limit of this as h approaches 0, the 2 doesn't change, so our answer is 2. So the second derivative of x squared is 2. In this exercise, you will compute the second derivative of x squared plus 2x. Please pause the video right now. Okay, you're back. So we plug into the definition of the second derivative difference formula. We get x plus h squared plus 2xh, 2x plus h, minus 2x squared plus 2x, plus x minus h squared plus 2x minus h over h squared. Now we expand the x plus h squared, and we expand the x minus h squared, and we combine them with the 2x squared. This formula um, eventually becomes 2 as it did in the last video, uh, as it did in the example, and 2x plus h minus 2 times 2x plus 2x minus h uh, will just become um, 2x minus 4x 
plus 2x is going to be 0, and h 2h minus 2h will be 0 as well. So we get again 2x, 2h squared over h squared plus 0 over h squared, and we get the limit of 2 as h approaches 0. And finally, this will equal 2. Thank you for listening.